Yo, 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 it's Jimmy G here, and welcome to another OP center backs, um, cheap, cheap center backs video. Um, here, uh, last video, I went over 83 through, or 80 through 83 rated center backs who are really great, um, relatively cheap, um, and I'll continue to do the same for you guys. Um, this one's going to be through 70, it's going to be 79 and 78 rated. Um, the reason why I'm doing those two ratings specifically is because there's just a lot of cards in here. Um, in those ranges that are really great um, that would be cheap and uh, pretty good to use as well um, for starter squads at least um, I really been appreciating your guys support um, if you guys go ahead like this video uh, that'd be great uh, leave comments below if, if I miss someone out um, that'd be amazing as well um, and social media is down below but let's go ahead and uh, get into the video so the first um, center back I, I have here for you guys is drum roll is Mercado um, he's a little bit shorter, 5'11", but two-star skill moves, three-star weak foot. Um, he medium-medium work rates, so he's a great pair for any La Ligas with medium-medium work rates or any Argentinians. Um, what I like about him is he has decent pace. Um, he's not terrible for center backs. He's 6 one shooting. Short passing is a 71. Um, he has pretty decent reactions as well as composure. Um, defense is solid and physicality is solid. So overall, you know, a real nice, solid uh, center back, um, true center back to have. Um, you know, with, with the previous videos that I've shown you guys um, on what chemi chemistry to apply, again, it's going to be the Sentinel because this, this is going to boost this card all the way up to an 87 rated. Um, I went through all the chemistries are rated already, and this is the highest rating um, for... Uh, for him, um, this is going to be the highest rating. I mean, a lot you'll probably see a lot of people applying to anchor or shadow. That's great. Um, I'm going to be applying to sentinel because I think that's going to be the best um, chemistry to apply to a center back. And he'll, I believe that he'll perform the best with, especially with the new chemistry um, ratings coming out. Um, but relatively cheap, guys. He is short, five eleven. So I don't know how how well he's going to be used. Uh, but let's go ahead and um, get into another Argentinian uh, center back for you guys. And this one's Abraham. Um, he's in the Bundesliga two-star skill moves, two-star weak foot. He's also medium, medium work rates. He's a taller, 6'2", um, which I like. Um, he has pretty good pace as well, 79 pace, um, 81 sprint speed. Um, shot power is a 74. Um, short passing is long passing. It's pretty good. Um, reaction is 76. Um, and his defense isn't bad. The only, the only problem I see with him is his stamina. Uh, but that's more than fine if you have another center back on the bench. Um, just bring him on. Um, again, I'm, I'm showing you guys this trend. Just apply a Sentinel to him, 87 rated. Um, if you guys want to apply an Anchor, that's more than 5. He's going to be 85 rated, but an Anchor still doesn't boost his stamina. I mean, he already has pretty decent pace, so I definitely recommend the Sentinel to get the extra 2 rating increase in-game um, and having that be an 87. <clears throat> but overall, solid player. Um, nothing to really complain about other than his stamina, but you could have someone on the bench to pop in. Um, for him if he's really that tired um, Next up I have another Bundesliga like I told you guys in the last video at the end of the last video um, Bundesliga is probably the way to go when you're looking at your back line <clears throat> So we have a kanji here 6-2 um, um, Great two-star skimmers three-star weak foot medium medium work rate. He's one of the fastest center backs in the Bundesliga um, 84 sprint speed, 76 acceleration. Short passing is actually really great as well. 77, long pass, 75. Um, reactions, ball control is pretty good. His agility and balance is a little bit higher than what you see in most center backs as well. Um, defense is, isn't bad other than his interceptions and head, heading accuracy could be a little bit better. But guess what? Guess what we're going to do? So we're going to apply a sentinel to him. Yep, yep, I'm showing you guys. Um, just because I was curious about this. He goes from a 78 to an 87 as well. Um, this is a phenomenal card. I'm going to be using this card as my starter squad um, just because he's going to have that strong leap with top rack as well. And then looking at the Bundesliga um, back line as well, I'll probably have um, top rack. My goalkeeper is going to be farming. And then I'll find a right, a, a two fullbacks to fill that spot, whether it's um, a hybrid or um, something else. Not, not really sure yet. I kind of want to see what I get from backs. Um, but yeah. Overall, really, really great uh, card. I definitely recommended him as you um, incorporate him into your starter team. Next up, we have a Calcio um, center back, Bastos. Um, Two-star, three-star weak foot, um, two-star skill moves, 5'11", medium high work rates. He's a Lazio player. Um, 
he is a little bit short, um, but he has decent pace, you know, decent physicality stats. Stamina is a little weak, but he also has really great strength as well. Um, his balance and reactions are pretty good as well. Um, so he's not going to really get pushed off the ball or fall. Um, 82 strength, 71 jumping, not bad. Um, if you guys follow the theme, apply Sentinel and it gets that um, from a 78 to an 86, uh, which is really great. Um, still, that stamina is a problem. Um, so one of the ways you're going to have to do is either have a sub off the bench or apply, you guys really wanted to apply chemistry to boost that, um, that, physic that stamina up. But overall, really solid center back if you're using a Calcio A. Um, he also has straw links with uh, other Lazio players who have um, pretty good uh, <clears throat> pr pretty good uh, center backs as well. And I have another one here for you guys. Another Bundesliga right here. We have Stark. Um, he's 6'3". He's great. He has a high attacking work rate, which I don't um, I don't like personally. If you have a high medium, I'm more of a medium high or a high high uh, type of guy. Two-star skill moves, three-star weak foot, a pretty decent pace. Um, his vision and his short passing is actually pretty good for a center back. Um, reaction 73. Um, his stamina and his jumping is a little weak. Um, I would say so, especially for being 6'3", uh, but that's fine. That's what you saw with the other German center back as well. Um, strength is pretty good, and his overall defense is pretty good as well. Um, so like I said before, apply that Sentinel on him, and it goes from a 78 to an 86, which is really great. Um, I mean, if you want to use him as a as a center defensive mid, you can throw a powerhouse on him as well. Um, but definitely a Sentinel will give him that 86 rated. Um, overall solid card, though. The Bundesliga 6'3", uh, high attacking work rate, medium defensive work rate. Really solid. I mean, you can pair him up if you saw the last video. You could pair him up with the other, uh, with the Vog. Vog, if you want to pair him up with him, it's strong links as well. Um, we have one more for you guys. The last Calcio A player for 78 rated. Um, it's uh, it's the Uruguayan Ur player for um, for Lazio. Strong link with Bastos, the previous center back I just told you. Medium high work rates. He is 5'11. Two star skin was three star weak foot. Even though he's 5'11, I'm not actually too worried about this car. The reason why is because one of the things I hope you guys notice is that his jumping stats is a 91 rated or 91, um, which is in insane. And his agility, his balance, his reactions is phenomenal. Um, his uh, acceleration 78 is really great. And then his defense is also really good as well. So this could be a hidden gem for you guys. I'm um, just just looking at this card. Uh, two star skin moves, three star weak foot. Definitely want to be applying that. His stamina is weak, um, but that's a common theme that I'm noticing with a lot of the center backs early on. Uh, but apply Sentinel, and then that will just really boost everything. It maxes out his jumping. He's going to be getting those headers, especially with 86 heading accuracy. It actually might not be a really bad play to have him on there. Overall, um, I think he's a really good, really good center back. Um, Calcio A with these two players I just showed you guys would actually be a pretty good um, substitute. Um, but yeah, guys, that's it. Um, that's all I have for you guys. Uh, just wanted to go run through this with you guys. I'm helping you guys find really cheap center backs, OP center backs that you guys are able to incorporate into your um, starter squads, um, whatever you guys are using. Um, I have one more video coming out, which is the 75 through 77 rated center backs. Um, that's going to be coming out soon. Um, Really appreciate the support. If you guys go, like this video, go ahead, give me a like. Um, throw something in the comments uh, if I miss someone or if, if uh, or who'd you like the best as well. Um, but yeah, guys, social media is down below. Jimmy G23 is out. Peace.